name is Jed McKeon, and today we are going to talk about probation and parole. These are two legal terms that get used frequently, and there's a difference between the two of them that most people might not know, and there's some similarities as well. So probation is something that people generally go on instead of going to jail. Instead of saying, okay, we're going to sentence you to jail for 60 days, that sentence will be what is called suspended, and you will be on probation for that 60-day period. Now, if you screw up during that probation period, you may end up going to jail for the rest of the time. But probation is pre-going to jail generally. Now, parole is a different type of supervision that you might find yourself on, and that is almost always after you go to jail for some period of time. So after you serve some sentence, 30 years or something like that, you may be on parole for another five or 10 years and you still have to report to a parole officer. So the differences and similarities between probation and parole. Now probation, you're generally still under the supervision of the court. If you violate your probation, you will end up back in front of a judge at some point to hear the case. On parole, you may have a 30-year sentence, do 10 years, and then come out on parole for the rest of the 20, but you are no longer under court supervision generally. You're under underneath a parole board who you'll answer to, and they're more involved in getting people rehabilitated, get them into halfway houses, find them jobs after they've spent a significant period of time in jail. And probation is before you go to jail generally. So those are some of the basic similarities and differences between probation and parole. You can find out more about this legal topic or, or other legal topics at my website, attorney-knoxville.com, or you can check out some of my other YouTube videos. You can also find me on Facebook and Twitter.